In a developing story, we continue with our storm coverage this evening. One of the hardest hit places up in Jefferson. Local 5's Larissa Leone is live there. One of the communities impacted from tonight's weather. Larissa. Yeah, you guys, to say that it's windy out here is a true understatement. Our weather team has it right up their alley. If you look behind me, you can see that there has been some significant damage over in Jefferson County. We have down power lines at this time. We also have debris from some buildings. And, um, you know, when we were driving up here to, to this location, there were a lot of trees and other areas that were blocking the road. So if you were driving in Jefferson County for any reason at this time, I would encourage that you pull over for a little bit to have some safety and look out for those roads. You know, guys, you really want to be mindful when these conditions are happening. It's not just, you know, the winds. It's also what's getting picked up from these winds. There's been several branches and stuff that have kind of flowed by us. So it's really imperative that you're being mindful tonight. If you're out, get in and just kind of watch your surroundings. Live in Jefferson, Larissa Leone, Local 5 News. We are Iowa. All right, Larissa, thank you. And Brad just mentioned to me that about three fourths of Greene County is out of power at this point. Easy to see why with the uh, wind and conditions like that will continue to follow the story throughout the evening.